Hi everybody, it's Anna and today's video is going to be a little bit different. Now, you're probably thinking, why is there a protein shaker? Why is she holding milk frother and just, she's also holding this bottle of shampoo? Um, I'm not making anyone a coffee, I'm not going to be drinking a protein shake and the shampoo I will tell you about now. So, I don't know if many of you have heard of this new craze, but basically frothing, um, it kind of cuts out that whole dilution, like water dilution shampoo step to your grooming. Uh, so it's really, really good if you're trying to save on your water bills or anything like that, because you don't use half as much water and you can actually use this froth and shampoo on a dry coat. Uh, it's really, really good for those hard to penetrate coats um, because as you'll see soon in this video, it literally just foams up into this big foamy bubbly mess, which is amazing. I literally can't wait. I'm gonna feel like such a scientist. I should really have got a lab coat for this, but um, basically I'm gonna be testing it with two methods. So I've got my, we already know which one I'm gonna pick because I'm a child. I'm obviously gonna want that. Anyway, and this method, so you basically put a wee bit of shampoo, a wee bit of water, shake, shake, shakey, and it just froths up. Same with this, you just put it in a container, a wee bit of water, a wee bit of shampoo. Weapon of mass destruction is what we're saying here. So anyway, I will be testing both these methods. I will be testing both these methods and I'll show you me mixing them. Now this is my first time doing this so you can't be judging me because I'm not really sure I'm confident but we'll see, we'll see. Anyway, let's go, let's go. Okay, first up, I'm using the milk frother, milk frother method, kind of hard to say. I think I've maybe added a little bit too much water. I've just got a tiny bit of shampoo in there too. As you can see, I'm excited, nervous, never done this before. Right. I really hope it works. I'll be so embarrassed if it doesn't. Right, okay. Sorry, there was water on that. Just... No way. No. That's so good. No, literally. No. No, seriously. No, I am amazed. I am literally, look how much. No, look how much. I'm literally creating such a mess. No, look how much. That is crazy. No, honestly. That looks tasty, I would drink that. That is absolutely one of the best things I've ever seen in my life. Okay, next. I need to calm myself down here. Right, I've got some water in this. I'm gonna put some shampoo in. Literally not a lot. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna like this method much, just cause I'm a lazy girl. But let's see. Okay, I wish it was clear so I could show you, but anyway, here we go. Oh, it feels like it's working. No, that actually feels like it's definitely worked. Oh, <gasps> no, I just choked. No, 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 no. I think I prefer this one. Can you see? No, I am in shock. I can't believe this. Where has this been all my life? Literally, I thought this was gonna be my favorite method just because I'm a child and like to play with things like this, but no. This, this is insane. This is literally insane. Oh my, no, I can't go. Anyway, right, so now that we've got them all mixed up, I will, oh my, I'm out of breath after that. I need to calm myself down. Okay, anyway, now that we've got them all mixed up, I will be 
demonstrating how to use it on two big fluffy dogs. So I'm gonna use one method on one dog, the other method on the other and see if there's any difference. I literally, I am so in shock at this. I am in shock, literal disbelief. Anyway, we'll get to the next part. So next I will be washing some doggies with my really foamy, frothy shampoo. So far, it's, it's honestly a 10 for me. I can't believe it. I literally, I can't believe it. Anyway, let's go. Okay, you know what? I'm not just doing this because I want to play with the frother again, but see the way I've got, I think I maybe put too much water on this one. The fact I'm just down here. Oh my God, I keep doing that. Okay. Oh. Can you see? I just missed some water, I guess. I don't know. I do think I put a little bit too much water in that. But we're all new here. Trust the process. Anyway, I'm going to wash some dogs now. Okay, so here we have Baloo and with him, I am trying the milk frother method of frothing. So I am gonna wet his coat first. You can, it says you can do this dry and you'll still get really, really good results. In fact, some people say they prefer doing it dry because they get better results. But I'm gonna whack the coat on Baloo and then maybe with the protein shaker um, froth, I will maybe do him dry. But let's see how we get on first. Okay, so as you can see, Baloo is all wet, apart from his head. I wanna start off just by, I wanna show you the consistency of this. So if you look, like it's actually like so soft, like it actually just feels like, I don't know if I it. But anyway, let's, I put it in a jug by the way, just because I wasn't sure how much to make and I didn't want to run out. Um, so I'm just using it from this jug, but let's see how it goes. I don't know what the best way, if I should pour or if I should... Let's see, there's kind of a lot of water. Hey, big man. What do you think of this? Oh, wow. Okay, okay. So far, oh, sorry. No, this is good. This is good. Blue. This is good. Sorry, I think I'm in the way. Blue, come here. Come here. Find your audience. Find your audience. Oh no, this is this is really good stuff. No, I really. Also, kind of many times I say no in this video, but I seriously approve. So I didn't even pour it. I'm just sort of scooping it out of the jug and spread it all around. And you can see some of the parts that I didn't really get very saturated in water. It still spreads so well and evenly. And it just seems to go on forever. Like This is actually one of the main things I love about this is so little goes such a long way with it. Um, Like you don't have to use a lot of the shampoo with a lot of water oh, to get loads of product, if that makes sense. But no, this is good and it actually smells amazing. It smells so good. Doesn't it look? Yes. Oh, yes, good boy. So as I said, this is the milk frother. Um, Just trying to make sure you can get a good view. Look at that. Okay, okay. That is a good job, okay. In the back of there, please. Blue likes it, blue approves. I'll show you what he looks like once I've got him all covered. In the suds. It did say in the directions to wet from the ears back or to apply it to the ears back, so. Oh, you're a good boy. Right, okay, I'll show you. Once I get them completely covered, I will show you, but this is what we're going with for now. 
Lily, what do you think? Hey? Eh? Okay, so this is how we're looking. I will let you know the results after I rinse, but so far I'm thinking this already seems like it's gonna do a way better job at actually cleaning his hair. Like it just seems like it goes so deep into the fur, right down into the skin. And um, it's got two oils in it. I think it's, you know what? I'm not even gonna say in case I get it wrong, but which is just amazing for like cleaning all the dirt and debris out of this big, big, thick coat. Eh? We'll get you rinsed and see what we think. Okay, so method number two, the uh, protein shaker, I think it's still my favorite so far. Like, wow. Wow. Now with this one, instead of like scooping it with my hand, I did pour it. So maybe that made a difference, but wow. Like, that is amazing. I can't get over this. Is this a new thing? Because why haven't I heard of it before? This is what I've needed my whole life. It just makes life so easy. Hey Bear, what do you think? Do you like it more than your brother? Does your brother like it more? Well, let's rinse you off and then I'm going to decide on my winner when I have both dogs completely dry, clean, funky fresh, and then we'll decide. But I think I already know. Ignore the loose hair background. I think I already know. Whoops. Who's one? I feel like Spider Man. Yes. Good boy. Right. We're going to decide a winner. I think. So after I finished drying Bear and Blue, I did sort of come to a conclusion that one of my methods was better. The results were better. And I think it was the protein shaker. Now, this doesn't necessarily mean anything because I did use the exact same shampoo both times. I just sort of preferred the way this actually frothed up and the way I was able to really spread it and scrub it round bare. Um, I also found his coat just seemed a lot cleaner than Baloo's, but that could be many factors. It doesn't necessarily mean one method is better than the other. It could have been the way I shook it, could have been the way I was using it. Do you know what I mean? Um, but I actually am obsessed with this whole frothing thing. It's definitely going to be something in my salon going forward. I am going to be using on a lot of dogs. Like those two dogs are using quite hard to get the shampoo down and into the skin. But with the frothing method, it just seemed so easy. So maybe after this video, you can all give it a try. It is, it, it is fun and I do think everyone who tries it will really be impressed with the results. So that's it for my video on frothing and um, hopefully you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Christie's Direct YouTube channel.